I think that's Tom there. You work here? Yeah. You could say that. Good. I need to see your boss. Really? Well, I'm sorry, Guaido. Mr. Tong Zi Hong sees no one today. Look, I didn't come halfway around the world to take no for an answer. Do us both a favor and tell me where he is. Or what? You get mad and tear down a few walls with those enhancements of yours? This place isn't named the Hive for nothing. It's got plenty of worker bees come out of the paneling to stop you. What is it you think Mr. Tong do for you anyway? I'm looking for someone. A cybersecurity specialist named Ari Van Bruggen. You know him? Never heard of him. What do you do? Steal your girl? Owe you money? He had a job go bad, and now he's on the run from the people who hired him. But you knew that already, because a man like Mr. Tong doesn't hire idiots. And this is the first place people like Van Bruggen come when they need... help. So stop wasting my time, and take me to Tong. You've got it backward, boy. You're wasting my time. Van Bruggen is minor league player. Tong knows who he is. He just don't care. He's got bigger things to worry about. Yeah, as long as Tong is right behind, I can help him catch up, but only if we pull our information. Insist. Another idea. Let's get out of there and see Tom before I stop asking this. Pinpoint. Uh -huh. You expect me to fall for that? Small timers don't attract this much attention. They don't have bell tower soldiers staking out their apartments. Van Bruggen's pissed off somebody big. And there's no way Tom's going to ignore that kind of development in his town. You smarter than you look. Yeah. Tong is keeping a close eye on things. Like you said, he's no fool. Now it's time you are leaving. Go back to your own country. There's nothing for you here. Give me a break. I've been on this island long enough to know that Van Bruggen can't leave without Tong's help. He has to be hiding in Lower Hangsha somewhere, and Tong can tell me where. Here's how little I care about what you know. We have Van Bruggen, and we're keeping him somewhere safe. It doesn't matter whether you have that information or not, because you got no idea what to do with it. You came here with nothing. And now you know more than you deserve. In return, all you give me is a pain in my ass. It's time for you to go. Or else. I'll do this. Say anything to get rid of me, won't you? There's no way Tong can hold on to Van Bruggen for long. Not with the kind of resources his enemies are throwing into the search. He'll be dead within a week, and Tong with him. Unless somebody, namely me, takes the heat off, and soon. The only threat to Tong's lifespan is if I let you in to talk to him, and you bore him to death. Get out of here, while you still have the breath to bore me. Okay. Let's go down and talk to the bar man again. Apparently. You got a favorite poison? Tong wasn't upstairs. He wasn't? You checked the lounge and he wasn't there? No, and I really need to see him. Where is he? Eh. 
Sometimes you have to prove yourself to Tong first. But today could be your lucky day, Lao Wei, because I just might be able to help you out with that. Is that so? And just how much is this help likely to cost me? That all depends on you, my friend. I got a problem I need solving. Trouble is, none of my usual guys are available. And this problem, it involves a woman. Someone who owes Tong money. Getting it out of her is proving to be... difficult. It's a dirty job, but it might just get you what you want. You interested? Indeed I am. Tell me more. I'm listening. That's what I like to hear. This woman, Jaya, she's a broker. Highly competitive field in Hengsha. But without the right skills, her business wasn't doing so well. So, we helped her out. Gave her a nice social enhancement upgrade chip, so she could understand her clients' needs. Now, it's time to pay us what's due. But she says she won't. So basically, you want me to be your collector? Yes. But it's not as simple as that. The girl's gone into hiding and thinks we won't find her. But she also took her phone and computer along to keep her business alive. Not very smart. Assuming you've got the equipment to track those. We don't exactly. But we know someone who does. And that's where you come in. Bao Tower set up a surveillance network around town. A series of relay antennas. I need you to hack them. Three relays should be enough for us to access the database and triangulate Jaya's position. Then I go get your money. Exactly. The first relay is on the rooftop of a four-story building in the Yuzhou district. I assume you've got an info link and Wayfinder package in those fancy orgs of yours? Hello. I'll upload the coordinates and then contact you once you've hacked in. Okay. Side mission priority. The side mission not our priorities to me. Come on, there we go. So I need to go hack into one of the relays that appear to be available. Fucking hell, so many people are coming online. Or going offline and back online. I keep, I keep seeing the Skype thing flash. Bottom right hand corner. I don't know if you guys can, but... Okay. Uh, okay. So, just here, good, not far. Good job, Lao Wei. I see you found the first relay. Now hack it and turn off its security protocols. On it. Oh. Oh shit, that's new. I need to get three of them. Fuck. Access granted. There we go. One down, two to go, my friend. Okay. Let's into this one. I'm gonna get used I'm gonna get into the fortifying aspect of this. Only one remaining. 
Let's go get the third one. Good question would be how. I took out the people on the roof, so that's fine. I love hacking, because it's like... You get a bit of adrenaline from it, but it's also scary as shit. What? I got all three, didn't I? Hang on, that's confusing as shit. I got all three. I swear I did. Huh. Interesting. Give it a second to cool down, then I'll try hacking again. Because I prefer not to use one of those devices in case I come across like a level 5 security system or level 4. Something like that, I can use the automatic unlocking devices for that. Oh, I don't think I got this one here. Shit, I'm a dumbass. Excellent work. I'm starting the triangulation now. Should have a location very soon. And... I've got it. Jaya is hiding in an apartment building called the Hengsha Court Gardens in the Yuzhao district. I'm sending you her coordinates. Get over there and get us the money she owes. Oh, fucking typical. I know another way in the building. The way I came. Going up. Okay, and we are there. Yes, I will. Who are you? Another one of Tong's thugs? Well, get out! I told him I won't pay another credit! I'm collecting that money with or without your consent. It's nothing personal. It's nothing personal, lady. I'm just here for the money. Give it over and I go. Sure, it's nothing personal to you, but it is my money you're stealing. Stealing? They got you the augmentation you needed, and they expect you to pay for it. Not the most charitable thing to do, but I would hardly call it stealing. Are you really that gullible? Tongue doesn't run a buy now, pay later operation. It's more like a buy now, pay forever. Listen, I just started as a broker. Most other brokers come from rich families. They paid for augments that give them an incredible edge in the business. There's no way I could afford anything like that through legal channels. So you cut a deal with a crime syndicate? I didn't study this hard to end up with nothing. Once I made enough money, I offered to pay for the AUG. But no, what they want is part of my monthly profits. They say they're entitled to it since it's their upgraded 